Dear citizens of Russia, I congratulate you on the day of reunification of the Donetsk and Lugansk People's Republics, Zaporozhye and Kherson regions with Russia, a year ago, on September 30th, the defining, truly historical and fateful event took place. Agreements were signed on the admission of four new constituent entities of the Russian Federation to Russia. Millions of residents of Donbas, Kherson and Zaporozhye regions have made their choice to be with their fatherland. People made this conscious, long-awaited, hard-fought and truly popular decision together during referendums in full compliance with international standards. They showed courage and unyielding character. They tried to intimidate them to take away the right to determine their own future, their destiny, to take away what is dear to every person, culture, traditions, native language, everything. That was hated by the nationalists and their Western patrons, who staged a coup in Kiev in 2014 year, and who then unleashed a full-scale civil war, terror against dissidents, organized a blockade, constant shelling and punitive actions in the Donbas. But nothing and no one can break the will of millions of people, their faith in truth and historical justice. The people of Russia supported the free and unambiguous choice of our brothers and sisters with all their hearts. We understood and deeply felt the main thing. By defending our compatriots in the Donbas and Novorossiya, we are defending Russia itself. We are fighting together for the motherland, for our sovereignty, for spiritual values and unity, for victory. I thank all citizens of our country for this unity and patriotic spirit. Today we are also creating our common future together. We are restoring and building schools and hospitals, houses and roads, museums and memorials. All our regions provide truly fraternal assistance to the cities and towns of Donbas and Novorossiya, volunteers, public and religious organizations, parliamentary parties, entrepreneurs and labor collectives contribute to this work, to this common cause. Our entire large and united country is doing a common cause, an important step in strengthening our common state, political and legal space was the recent elections in the Donetsk and Lugansk People's Republics, in the Zaporozhye and Kherson regions, just like a year ago, at historical referendums, people again expressed and confirmed their will to be with Russia. They supported their fellow countrymen, those who, through work and real deeds, earned the people's trust. There is a lot of work ahead and the solution of complex problems. The implementation of a large-scale program for the revival and socio-economic development of our historical regions. And we will definitely achieve our goals. I want to especially address the residents of the Donetsk People's Republic, Lugansk People's Republic, Zaporozhye and Kherson regions. Thank you for the fact that, despite all the trials, you preserved and passed on your love for the fatherland to your children. Thanks to you, your firmness and determination, Russia has become even stronger. We are one people and together we will overcome everything. We will respond to any challenges. Happy holiday, dear friends. Happy reunification day with Russia.